Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can enter an expense ticket to record resources that were used for a customer, a job, or simply for internal administrative purposes. You can also choose to bill your customers or jobs for charge items that are included on billable expense tickets. To create an expense ticket, select Tasks from the menu bar, roll down to the Time and Expense command, and then choose the Expense Tickets command. That will then display the Expense Tickets window. And first you need to select whether this is an expense to be recorded for an employee or vendor by selecting the desired option button that appears within the Whose Expense is Being Recorded section. You can then use the adjacent drop-down within that same section to select the specific employee or vendor for whom you are recording the expense. Next, within the Why is this ticket being recorded section, you use the drop-down to select whether this ticket is being recorded to be applied to a customer invoice, or to record job expenses, or is it simply being recorded for administrative purposes. Now, if you select either the To a Customer Invoice or Against a Job Choice from the drop-down menu, then use the Adjacent drop-down that appears within this same section to select the specific customer or job for which this ticket is being recorded. Next, in the Item Details section, select the desired charge item for which you are recording an expense ticket. Now, if the charge is to be used in future invoicing, you can enter a description that can be used within the invoice into the Invoice Description field. Then, in the Ticket Details section, use the drop-down to select the date for the expense ticket. If the expense is to be reimbursed to the employee, you may check the Reimbursable to Employee checkbox. In the Billing Details section, you can use the Billing Status drop-down, to select a billing status for the expense ticket if it is being recorded for a customer or a job. You can then use the quantity, unit price, and or billing amount fields to record the necessary information for billing the customer or job. To record the expense ticket, simply click the Save button in the toolbar at the top of the window when you're finished. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.